he is suing to keep TikTok. He said, I'm going to file a lawsuit challenging the TikTok ban on constitutional grounds. Don't be fooled. The TikTok ban is not about China harvesting your data. That's a smokescreen. Intelligence agencies from lots of countries, especially ours, are harvesting your data from everywhere all the time. TikTok isn't even majority Chinese owned, and the company agreed to put its data behind a U.S. firewall, but the Biden administration rejected that deal. Congress and the administration don't understand that TikTok is an entrepreneurial platform for thousands of American young people. They want to screw them over just so they can pretend to be tough on China. The TikTok ban is yet another example of how neither political party has any compunctions about sacrificing your freedoms, rights, and choices when it comes to their political interests. So do you think this is going to get RFK Jr. more votes come November? As always, let me know what you think about all of this down below. Breaking news, RFK Jr. just announced that he is suing to keep TikTok. He said, I'm going to file a lawsuit challenging the TikTok ban on constitutional grounds. Don't be fooled. The TikTok ban is not about China harvesting your data. That's a smokescreen. Intelligence agencies from lots of countries, especially ours, are harvesting your data from everywhere all the time. TikTok isn't even majority Chinese owned, and the company agreed to put its data behind a U.S. firewall, but the Biden administration rejected that deal. Congress and the administration don't understand that TikTok is an entrepreneurial platform for thousands of American young people. They want to screw them over just so they can pretend to be tough on China. Mm -hmm, the TikTok ridiculous. ban is yet another example of how neither political party has any compunctions about sacrificing your freedoms, rights, and choices when it comes to their political interests. So do you think this is going to get RFK? You know what, guys? Here it is. You guys have to be ready for it. Uh, welcome back to SA Blog Nobu Media. We are... You just kind of follow us. Check for SC Blog Global Media on all social media. We're on YouTube, we're on Facebook, we're on TikTok, and we are on Instagram as well. But now, here it is. TikTok is actually going to be banned. Like, um, the House of Rep have actually gathered all the votes. And uh, it seems majority takes their votes. And they have a lot of... Um, yes 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 and then they nay nay all right but here it is we are not giving up we are not giving up hope because the, is this a political interest or what is it you know because there are a lot of entrepreneurs just like us that are actually using the platform of um, tiktok and millions and thousands of others like that okay now you guys have heard i believe this is going to take effect on september 9 right september 9 and you guys have heard on the news like uh tiktok has tried their best to strategize to actually uh strike a deal with united states of america that is uh administration of uh what is the name of their president again i'm really sorry this is not the time to forget the name of the president of uh joe biden darling joe biden's uh administration has actually uh refused the deal that was strike with uh with us that deal is them actually uh, posting their like their data, their data behind U.S. Uh, firewall, but uh, the the administration of Biden actually refused it. So now, and according to the news again, what I actually picked up was that um, TikTok wasn't really owned by hundred uh, percent Chinese. Uh, individuals but it is not a chinese company you know it is an entrepreneurial platform now what is uh, mr chow chu going to do he is the ceo of uh, tiktok 
and probably this is going to this of course that is where his uh, income you know uh, lie from uh, to actually make a decent living to support his family yes um since he has tried to actually it's like okay here's my daughter let's let's just put it behind the u.s war and the uh, biden administration actually refused what does you guys expect from him and now you guys have heard how jfk uh, you know coming in and said he is going to actually file a lawsuit for the ban of uh, tiktok on a constitutional right it's kind of like everybody does it you know all the intelligence international intelligence uh, agencies they actually gathered uh, our data yeah uh yes he's telling the truth we know that all right and it's like especially us as long as you guys are using all those data to an advantage not leaking it out you know uh not compromising our safety you know so we know that uh, you know international agencies they go after uh mostly individuals and as jfk has actually mentioned like especially us you know or uh, his this is all political interest and uh, another election is coming and it's like is this going to be to his own interest i have no idea i have no idea the it could be to his interest if he actually swing uh us for banning tiktok if he actually came through on september 9 2024 that is in about uh june july august and july that is now about four months now all right so it is unfortunate it is really unfortunate what is going to become of uh, mr chow chu well he created the uh, tiktok he can actually you know develop another app yes he has done it before he can do it again but we are hoping and believing that tiktok is not going to actually be uh banned otherwise there are people there are other things that can be done uh facebook is still there and um is the target facebook is still there we need to and uh youtube get our shit there. together and unite Instagram before is there. this LinkedIn happens is there. Only the Otherwise, if they take this platform on away, different, uh, levels. I don't know where we can go. You know, so, In the comments below, yeah, what other platform so, should we go to? What, uh, Leave what your comments. Right the nays are 352, the nays are 65. There you have it, TikTok's banned. They passed the... So you guys have heard it. We have said this. Bill, you know the what's happening? September 9th, 2024 is the target we need to get our shit together and unite before this happens otherwise if they take this platform away i don't know where we can go in the comments below what other platform should we go to leave your comments the nays are 352 the nays are 65 there you have it. TikTok's banned. They passed the bill. You know what's happening? Oops, September 9th, 2024 is the target. We need to... Fire. The Lord told me to take this oh, answer my to some that you're going to speak truth. No, 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 no. We don't want this one. You will tell them what the Lord says. He said, what are they together? And you sorry, know, sorry, before everybody. Before this happens, otherwise if they take this platform away... <laughs> I don't know where we can go. We don't know. Where? In the comments below, what other platform should we go to? Come November, as Leave always, your let me know what you think Days about all of this down below. Breaking news: RFK Jr. just announced that he is suing to keep TikTok. He said, "I'm going to file a lawsuit challenging the TikTok ban on constitutional grounds." Don't be fooled. The TikTok ban is not about China harvesting your data. That's a smokescreen. Intelligence agencies from lots of countries, especially ours, 
are harvesting your data from everywhere all the time. TikTok isn't even majority Chinese owned, and the company agreed to put its data behind a U.S. firewall, but the Biden administration rejected that deal. Congress and the administration don't understand that TikTok is an entrepreneurial platform for thousands of American young people. They want to screw them over just so they can pretend to be tough on China. The TikTok ban is yet another example of how neither political party has any compunctions about sacrificing your freedoms, rights, and choices when it comes to their political interests. So do you think this is gonna get RFK Jr. more votes come November? As always, let me know what you think about all of this down below. Breaking news.